what's up YouTube, Jeff back again today, another very exciting Samsung video for you guys, and today we're going to be talking about the rollout schedule for One UI 7.0 stable update for the Galaxy S, A, and Z series. We have a leak now from Samsung Romania that shows the release timetable internally within Samsung, and I don't want to tell you guys it's good news because it's not. It looks like it's not going to be rolling out until starting in April which is something we kind of already expected, but now we have more confirmation of that. Before we get into that, I want to remind you guys, check out our website, samiguru.com, covering the latest Samsung news, tips, tricks, tutorials, and reviews. And we did cover this update yesterday in real time as it was breaking. We have a brand new writer as well, Josh Skinner, that Josh guy, 69, over on X. You guys may know him. Covers a lot of Samsung stuff over there. He has joined us as a freelance writer. Certainly want to welcome him to the team as well. If you guys haven't ordered your S25 device yet, check out the Mystery Box program. It's ending in a couple days and will be replaced with Sammy Guru Rewards, which is our new rewards program. You can get awesome gifts for ordering a Samsung product anytime throughout the year if you go through our website. Also give you some really cool perks, uh, free wallpapers every day, and some other items to enhance your Galaxy fan experience and smartphone use experience every day. Anyway, definitely check that out and let's get into today's story right now. Basically, this information was shared uh, in an internal Samsung Romania meeting and then was uh, leaked over on X by user Beliga David Cree one um, You can see here the internal timeline. We also have the image on the website here. S24 family, 18th of April, including the S24 FE. The S23 family starts the week after that on the 25th of April. S23 FE is actually three weeks later on the 16th of May, as well as the S22 series, and then the S21 on the 23rd of May, which is nearly three months away from right now. Now looking at the Z uh, series, Flip 6 and Fold 6 on the 18th of April, which is the same as the S24 series, that's very nice to see for our foldable users out there because typically they get delayed beyond the previous year's S phones just because of the foldable form factors harder to develop the update for. Then the following week, you'll see on the 25th, you'll get the Flip 5 and the Fold 5 the same time as the S23, Flip 4 and Fold 4 have to wait another uh, three weeks, just like the S23 FE and the, S, uh, the S22. And then the S21 series and the Flip 3 Fold 3 will release on May 23rd. Now down here, you've got the A54, A34, A53, and A33. You've got April 25th, the 16th of May, respectively for the A series 34, 53, and 33 phones. Um, now this rumor was corroborated by the one Sid, who's another leaker. Um, who has a pretty good track record with Samsung software leaks. You can see this internal meeting screenshot that was supposedly shared from Samsung Romania as well on our website. Um, this is very interesting. Um, we broke it down in a table here that's a little easier to read that's in English, obviously, as you can see it. Now, we don't know about any other phones, but these are the only ones that were shared in the meeting. These are, of course, the big series that we're kind of waiting for, One UI 7. So in terms of other devices, we don't really know. It is very strange, and Josh, our writer, mentioned this, very notably, that the A55 and the A35 are both available in Romania, but these were left out of this particular screenshot. And it's kind of strange because this was supposedly from a Samsung Romania internal meeting. You would think that these two phones, the A55 and A35, that are both available in that market, would have been discussed and listed in this particular screenshot that leaked, if it leaked from Romania anyway. Um, anyway, because some other leakers corroborated this, this seems like a reasonable timeline. I have to say, very, very disappointing. April 18th means we're still waiting another six and a half weeks um, for the S24 series. We're definitely going to get another beta. Almost certainly that Z Flip 6, Z Fold 6 beta is going to come to fruition. That's probably going to arrive around the same time the next S24 beta release will come. Probably good, though, to test this on the foldables um, because the foldables, obviously, like I said, different form factor. They have some other challenges and bugs that need to be tested before you roll that out as a stable update. I know a lot of you guys are going to be very disappointed about this. Uh, we had a live stream last week kind of getting out all of our anger about the delays. Definitely happy to talk with you guys more about it in the comments below. The S25 series finally got its first update. Still waiting on the October security patch as well for the S25, which is still on October 2024. It's awful. We really need a new security patch there. Samsung's got to get on the ball. But I think One UI 7 as a whole, as much as I know people keep, you know, hate to hear this, but it's worth it. They made massive overhauls. They changed a lot of things that we wanted. They gave you freedom to change animations. I mean, at the end of the day, all we can do is wait, even though I know it is very, very disappointing. And Samsung should have did much better with the planning. Anyway, hope you guys enjoy the information. Check out SammyGuru.com for more great updates on this. The uh, mystery box program for the S25 is almost over. 
Sammy Guru Rewards will be opening, and then you'll be able to claim your mystery gifts any time of year. So make sure to check out the newsletter for that. I'll see you guys in the next one. Thanks so much for watching.